it's Jenny from Homestead Corner, and today I've got a budget prepper pantry haul from the Dollar Tree. I picked up 18 items, and all but three of them had tax on them. Just the food doesn't have tax. Um, and so we, it was 18.83 was the total for 18 items. So we have five and a half percent sales tax here, except for food items, and there are only a couple. Uh, so let's get started. I got, uh, you always want to remember your pets when you are prepping, make sure you have plenty of supplies. Uh, my dogs love these dental like bones, they are made in the USA and they are my dogs just go nuts over them they love them it's their favorite nighttime snack and they usually get them about twice a week so they just they love them they want them all the time <laughs> it's their favorite so we try to make sure we have plenty of those on hand and whenever i see them there i grab them there they do sell them at walmart but they are quite a bit more it's a much larger package but uh, per piece, it costs way more. I can, I can get more buying them by the dollar bags. So, and the next thing I got is something that we recently found within the last month or so, and it is the Outrageous Quick Oats, the One Minute Oats. We love these. Um, I grabbed two more packages of them. They didn't have many in stock, and, um, but they are, they are really, really quick to cook up. You can add boiling water. It's kind of almost like an instant oatmeal. They're cut kind of small. So they're great for cooking and they're also great for really quick oatmeal. So in an emergency, if you don't want to waste fuel, just boil water. You can pour in and just let it sit a couple minutes and it'll, it's ready to go, which is awesome. And we like to add in some, you know, freeze-dried fruits or stuff like that, apples, strawberries, raspberries, blueberries, whatever we have, bananas, whatever we have, throw a little bit in there, and, you know, a little bit of maple syrup or something. It really makes it a nice oatmeal, and we really like these. So uh, the next thing, I got one other food item, and that was this. It's a six-ounce bag of golden, I think it's called quinoa or quinoa. Uh, I don't know I've heard it said a million different ways and I'm sure I'm butchering it and that's okay because <laughs> I'm okay with that so I did pick up this it is a six ounce package which is kind of small but for a dollar it really wasn't a bad deal the um, 14 ounce packages at Walmart it's a different brand but those are like five bucks so I think they were 478 or something for a 14 ounce package and so it would take a little more than two of these and only a buck a piece so that is perfect so i just bought one bag to give it a try and see how we like it um it is a great alternative to rice in rice dishes and things like that you can use it a bunch of different ways uh it's great with lentils it's good with all kinds of stuff so i just bought one bag just to try and see how we like it and if we like it i'll definitely it's a good buy, so I'll definitely be looking at more of this. And then I got a couple of household items. Uh, these scrub buddies work really good. You get 10 in a box for a buck, which is a great deal. And I cut these in half, you know, they're just like the SOS pads. I cut them in half. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to mess with them or anything. Just, I cut them all in half, stick them all back in the box and use them that way I get 20 out of it that way because there's always that piece that gets nasty and I know you can put it in the freezer but I'm bad with that stuff I got so much stuff to do it's <laughs> I really I know I could do it <laughs> definitely I'm being realistic though <laughs> And the next thing that I really like from there, these are scrub buddies also, and these are like the magic erasers. You get two for a dollar. These work great, especially if you're cooking out on the fire. Those enamel pans get completely black when you're cooking out there. This, it wipes right off. It takes all that soot off, cleans it up really nice, looks good afterwards. And we love these for all kinds of things. Having kids, 
these make cleanup really easy because my kids are a disaster. I don't know if it's just my kids or everybody's kids are like that. <laughs> but uh, so we did get two of those. And then these were new. I hadn't seen these before. Coralite pain relief patches. They're small ones. I have seen the big ones, a different brand. I think it's the Assured that they carry. And I have tried those and they work really good. These are a little bit smaller and it appears that they are for, you know, like ankles and things like that. So, you know, smaller areas, uh, joints, things that, like that. So you get 20 in here for a buck. So I thought these would be great to give a try. Um, if you have, you know, if they work really good, they would be perfect for sticking in your bags and things like that. Your get home bag, your getaway bag, your any bag you have. Um, but I'm, we're going to give these a try as well. And I only buy one of those when it is something new because I've bought plenty of things that I didn't like. So I will let you know how we like those. And then extra care, 70% hand alcohol, 70 alcohol hand sanitizer. They're little individual, 24 individual little packets. And I thought these would be perfect for, you know, in the car, in the bags, in your purse, in your pockets, wherever, you know, they're flat, little teeny, single use ones, perfect. I love that kind of stuff. Uh, it makes it really handy. Keep them in those small first aid kits and stuff like that because it's hard. You can't keep a bottle in those small first aid kits. So this works out great. You can just throw a handful of them right in there. And then I grabbed, these are two and a half gallon um, Ziploc bags. I love the bigger bags for holding things together, especially supplies and things like that. If you don't have lots of containers, these bags work great for, you know, put stashing all your candles in, stashing all your whatever matches in. It's going to help keep them dry and it helps keep them all together too. And you only get five of these bags, but they are nice big two and a half gallon size bags. So we really like these. They're good for collecting, foraging, keeping your documents dry in your bags, um, all kinds of stuff. There's so many things that you can do with plastic bags. Lug water if you have to, anything, really. Thinking outside the box is the best thing you can do. <laughs> um, you can always find up, come up with another use usually for an item. It's not just to put watermelon or fruits in like the, you know, the box shows. The next thing is matches. I like these little boxes. Um, you get 320. The big box is you get 300 in it. So there's uh, extra 20 matches in here. I don't care if it's the big box or the small box. They all light fires. And the next thing I got was I got an extra sharpening stone. I picked one of these up a few months back and it worked really well. Um, it's a wet stone. You want to be careful if you get this and drop it, it is going to break. They are pretty fragile, but this is great to keep your knife sharp. I just wanted to have an extra one on hand. Um, when you're sharpening your knives, it's nice to have the tools that you need. If you don't have anything to sharpen knives with, over time your knives are going to get dull. And if you can't get new knives, you're going to struggle with a dull knife. So. Um, definitely for a buck this is well worth it the wet stones are usually a heck of a lot more than this so and the last thing I got I have been looking for these for months and months and months and our store just did not carry them I have asked and asked and um, I've seen them on other people's videos and I think they are definitely I think Oh, I can't remember. It's been months since I've seen them anywhere, but, uh, but I have seen them other videos and they are called Fancy Heat. They're like Sterno and they sell these in the party supply section is where I found them today. And these are just, it's like a little Sterno can. You can cook with it. Um, in the party supply section, they're for, you know, putting underneath the pans to keep the food hot and stuff like that which is perfect. There's a little oil in there and a wick 
and just light it up. So I wanted to give these a try because I have seen other people grab these before and for only a buck, Sterno at Walmart is like $3 a can. And if this works just as good and lasts as long, might as well do it. So we're gonna be giving this baby a try. Maybe we'll cook up some quinoa with it and, and I'll do a video. We'll see how it goes. <laughs> you never know, you never know might be the best stuff ever and that is it for my haul today I wanted to add just a few things extra top off some spots try out a couple of new things that we found I'm excited to try these pain patches see how those are because there's nothing worse than pulling a muscle and you can't do anything and when you have to do it you might as well you know have something like this that you can put on and just help you get through it and you know might not be the best option but if it works and it helps it's definitely worth a buck and that's it for today if you like this video give me a thumbs up subscribe we'll see you in the next video bye